All right. What I'm going to do is uh, uh, suggest that uh, if, if there's no uh, other immediate questions that people want to ask, um, then uh, we can move to going ahead to the closing remarks. But, um, and I don't have slides prepared for this, but there are some things I want to make sure to, um, to, touch, uh, to touch on. One, of course, the first one, of course, is the survey uh, that Lori has uh, cut and pasted in there. And I noticed it doesn't render as a link, so you'll have to um, paint it and then copy it over in order to be able to use it. But do please uh, fill that out. Uh, we'll be following up with an email for you to, to fill that out with. Another one is that, again, uh, for the training event today, there were notebooks for you to uh, test things out with uh, yourself. And uh, you can run them on the Cori GPUs. And if you didn't get a chance to do it before the event today or during the event today, then um, if you don't otherwise have uh, GPU access, then you should be able to keep, uh, keep that access until April 20th. So that's about a week from now. Uh, to try those out. So we encourage you to do that. And if you have any questions, you know, just uh, just email Lori or me. Um, the next thing I wanted to say, um, of course, was I wanted to really um, express our gratitude from NERSC to um, the presenters today from NVIDIA, uh, not just for the work that they've done and looking at our workflows and uh, using that to inform their product development, uh, and also give us feedback uh, about the workflows uh, like you saw today, but also their, their presentations and the time that they took um, to prepare those. Um, I know that, they, they, that you do do this a lot, but um, you did incorporate into the things you were showing today, stuff that was really specific um, to our workflows and really important to the kind of concerns that our users have. So uh, I, I wanna express that um, gratitude again. Um, Aside from uh, that, I think that um, we don't have too much else to add. And so uh, if there's, I'll, I'll do one last, uh, one last ask for questions here. Um, but if there aren't any, then we can let our, let our presenters go and enjoy the rest of their evening. And it's really well deserved. I have um, a quick short question. Uh, sure. Uh, regarding the CUML, uh, notebooks. Uh, where is the parallelism happening in that? So these are scikit-learn, uh, uh, you know, progression or uh, 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 workflows. Where exactly is the parallelism happening? Is it is it data parallelism? Um, so in the in the notebooks, there's parallelism happening all over. Um, so not with scikit-learn necessarily, but with the QML and the, and the GPU based algorithms, um, the parallelism is, is happening all over. Um, so there's only one machine. So there, there's already model. It's like, there isn't model parallelism because there's only one model here because there's one, there's one worker, one machine. Um, and so it's, it's just a parallel in the, in the linear regression one. Um, I forget this, whatever, it depends on the solver. It's either a parallel closed form solution um, or it's a parallel, um, I guess, Eigen decomposition solution. I forget what it was, but um, it's it's just a parallel algorithm on a single machine. Okay. Yeah, uh, that, that's correct. I just wanted to add to that. Yeah, you're right, Nick. It was the Eigen decomposition solver um, in the notebook example, and it's just a parallel algorithm. Um, and we didn't have that example in this notebooks, but uh, we have other ones for uh, Dask QML too. Um, so if you're interested, there's a lot of links um, on. Rapids AI's GitHub, um, a lot of great notebooks that I recommend looking into those as well. I'll share the link in the chat actually. Thanks, Sarah. I think uh, the, the first presentation had a, a final slide that included some handy links and uh, we'll make sure if, uh, if we haven't got that one already that we will, uh, that we'll include that one in there. Okay, thanks, thanks, Sarah. Okay, uh, so with that, um, I think what we're going to do is uh, we're going to shut off the recording and then we're going to go ahead and um, let everybody go a few minutes early here. Um, it's been a long day. Um, I want to thank everybody for uh, putting up with Zoom and doing this remotely. And uh, I hope that people found it useful. 
and uh, that they're able to use the, the notebooks and materials um, uh, that have been shared with them today uh, in their future workflows. Um, uh, finally, thanks again uh, to you guys from NVIDIA, from Rapids. We really appreciate it very much. Thanks, yeah, everyone. Thank you, guys. thank you all for it. Thank you. Thank right. you as well. Thank you, uh, Laurie and Roland, too.